Hey, this is Stacy from Let's Cook, y'all. Welcome back to our channel. I'm back from, as Tim says, what used to be my favorite place in the whole wide world, the grocery store or Kroger. However, I maintain it's not quite as fun as it used to be. It takes me a whole lot longer and trying to be careful, but I do wear a mask and I am trying to get some stuff on sales and combining coupons and I will try to put all that information below. I'll start off with the cold stuff. Tim needed some milk. I'm happy to report our milk is down a little more. The Kroger milk this week was $2.99 a gallon. Very cheap for us. I had a two combined digital rebates <laughs> for this A2 milk. Tim is gonna try it and see if he can taste the difference. We were almost out of eggs, so I've got two dozen. I've been eyeing this shaved beef at Kroger for a while to try, so I got that. I got some little yogurts for me. I have been using the Country Crop plant-based butter, but they only had the sticks at Kroger, and I like some spread for different things, so I had a digital coupon for this. I'll give it a try. They're Simple Truth brand. Some buns and tortillas for recipes. A couple of things of cheese, one sliced, one shredded. Tim will be uber excited to see something labeled tofu, T-O-F-U. Wow, do they make that in meat flavor? They don't make meat flavored tofu. Oh, okay. Hiding down here that Tim's not supposed to see from the clearance aisle, a little lint, dark chocolate, touch of sea salt, 49 cent bar. That goes directly in my stash. We had gotten pretty low on sodas, so I stocked up two Cokes for Tim, and he will also help me with root beer, which doesn't have caffeine in it. A few things to stock the pantry, some red lentils for recipes. What are you doing? Why Bart so why AW? I, I, I was having trouble figuring out... Vanna, hold them both up, Vanna. I was having trouble... <laughs> I was having trouble figuring out which one I wanted, so I got one of each. Isn't that terrible? For the pantry, some hamburger dill chips. Tim's favorite, a Thousand Island salad dressing, the Ken's brand. I used my last evaporated milk in a recipe, and I found some Kroger brand tomato sauce. Most of the cans were dinged, but I picked through them, found one marked down in the clearance for 39 cents. Some Jiffy corn muffin mix to keep in the pantry. I found my favorite organic slash healthy cereal on sale, so I got two boxes for the pantry. Some mini chocolate chips, some shelled edamame to keep in the freezer when we have Asian night, some tortilla chips, I think everything else is produce, coleslaw mix for recipes, English cucumber, strawberries, oh, red bell peppers for Tim, an onion. Red is your favorite color. That's my favorite color, but I, I don't like touching bell peppers. I don't like looking at them. I don't like but smelling them. the best them. thing is you can eat them. I don't like eating them. Oh. We've had this discussion, and everybody left some really nice ideas for things to do with bell peppers, so I got those for you, though, for a recipe. Some plums, squash, avocados, and I'm really excited. One night when Tim has red meat, I'm going to have some stuffed portobellas and lettuce, which is still not looking good. I had to pick through it. And I watched a Kroger click list girl pick lettuce for somebody and she just grabbed the first one and it looked awful. I felt sorry for whoever was getting that order. But that is our Kroger haul for probably the next week, week and a half. If you found any good deals or any tried any new products, be sure to leave us a comment as always. Thanks so much. You, you want to say it? I was just thinking this is my pick of what you bought. Of course it is. And I bought that just for you, sweetheart. Okay. You're going to be very excited to have that. You want to say thanks for stopping by? Thanks for stopping by. Have a wonderful and truly blessed day. Have a wonderful and truly blessed day. Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all. Bye. <laughs> and it wasn't groceries, but it was hiding in my purse. This was actually my best deal. This mascara, which I buy a lot at Kroger because I have coupons, was $6.99. It was a $3 digital Kroger coupon on my card, so that brought it to that brought it to $3.99. There's a $2 I bought a rebate, so that makes this mascara L'Oreal cost me $1.99. So, hooray. <laughs> I got some soda. Top dog buns.